defying the odds and winning the championship. It was a Cinderella season for Cardinal Hayes High School football team. And yet the team from the Bronx faced difficulties from day one. But through it all, they never gave up and made history in the process. Here's sports anchor Sam Ryan. The auditorium packed in cardinal red and gold, the entire student body and staff in attendance to celebrate the New York State champs, a first for New York City School. The Cardinals received their state medals today. I'm thankful for all the faculty and staff and administration that put this together because this is what my teammates and all my coaches deserve to have the entire student body come and celebrate what we did. Add that to the shiny new hardware on full display in the school's main hallway. This is the um, New York State Catholic High School Athletic Association football champions. This is the plaque that we get. This is from Saturday. Yes, yeah. that's from the game. This is the state trophy honoring us as the winner for the state. It's a great feeling. I actually walk in and just like stop and look at it every day for a second, just like take it in and like really be like, I really accomplished that on my team. We've heard about some of the adversity this team has faced. No lights, poor field conditions, all of their home games moved to road games. In addition, these seniors, they embarked on their high school career in 2020, the COVID year. That meant a hybrid school schedule. They weren't even allowed through the front door for part of the year and football was moved to the spring. They only played four games. They worked according to the regulations that the Archdiocese and the city and state had for us. They did their training out in the yard. And the statement that inner city kids were affected by the pandemic is so true. To watch them come storming back is. It's just amazing. And the celebrations don't end here. Coach O'Neill had the exciting task of awarding the school a day off for winning their Super Bowl the Monday following the NFL Super Bowl. 